everybody, it's Mary Ann from the North Grove and it's time for another creative caper. Today we're using tempera paint and this is paint I bought at Dollaramas. I put some in each dish. Got two beautiful colors, pink and blue, and they're both neon colors so they're really fun. And I went rooting around in the kitchen and this is what I found. I found a funny old spoon, a little sieve. I found a pancake flapper that looks like the gingerbread man. <laughs> I found some sort of whisk and a couple of potato mashers. And this little scoop for scooping things out of hot oil, I think. So what I'm going to do is paint with these utensils. So let's try the gingerbread man first. I'm going to make sure he has lots of paint on him. And then I'm going to press him down once, twice, three times. And now let's try this fun springy one. I think it's a type of whisk and it makes great circles. Let's try that again. There we go. And now a potato masher. I really like the way these look. If you hold it down nice and still, you get a good print. Okay, and then let's contrast that with this one because it has a different design. These are things you can find in your kitchen drawer or if you go to a yard sale. Sometimes you can pick up these fun things. Yeah, this one oh. <laughs> has two different little cups. One is slightly bigger than the other. So I'm going to do blue and pink. What design do you think it'll make? Two circles! <laughs> Lots and lots of holes. <laughs> uh, let's try blue. It's kind of fun to watch the paint pop through the holes. Okay. And, and I'm just going to rotate it slightly. <gasps> Very bumpy <laughs> looking. And I don't think we've tried the um, server, which I think is for pies, and I can see a triangle. Can you? <laughs> so I'm going to dip an edge in. Oh yes, it makes nice straight lines. And then I'll do the other with the contrasting color. I love it. Thanks, Maria. <laughs> it looks like you're designing a gift paper, like for wrapping oh, paper. Yes. that's this what so we cool. could do with this paper. Mm -hmm. And you can get a nice roll of paper at Dollarama as well, um, the brown craft paper. And so you can cover your entire table and make some gift wrap. I love how it. how fun is that? <laughs> this one's a little difficult to get some paint on it. And you kind of have to roll some of these. Mm -hmm. And some work better than others. And that's what the fun thing is to see. And then when you start mixing the paint, oh, look what's happening. We're getting some purple. And how pretty is that? But I think this one was my favorite yeah. because it's got that nice spring action. Yeah, and the bouncing. Oh, now it's beautiful. <laughs> Wing, wing, wing. <laughs> <laughs> and oh, I almost forgot this guy. Didn't use him. Now, I don't know what kind of design that'll make, but we'll, we'll try. Oh, just a little blobby. There we go. And this is something fun that you can do on a day when you're just wondering, what can I do? Make some art. Yay! Bye now. <laughs>